Hi, Candace. How are you? Hi, Winnie. How are you? I'm wonderful. How are you today? Doing great. Thanks. Thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. Oh, me too. Thank you. What's the biggest mistake working mothers are making when it comes to their health care choices? Well, working mothers are nothing short of super women, right? So we're juggling household and work. So probably the biggest mistake during this open enrollment period is working mothers are simply, because of shortage of time, just saying, I'll just pick the exact same benefits that I picked last year. And they don't take the time to evaluate all the options that their employer has um, offered them. So that's something you don't want to do. Definitely. And can you tell us about the survey and some of the surprising findings? Absolutely. So the AFLAC Working Mother Survey, we found this was very interesting to us. About 50% of those survey said that they were not in a position to cover their deductible costs on their medical insurance plans. And this cost could be from $1,000 or higher. So this is certainly something that mothers and families want to prepare for because if you don't, it could play havoc on your family's financial budget. Definitely. And what is a high deductible plan? So a high deductible plan is medical insurance that has a lower premium but a much higher deductible. So a lot of times we all feel that, you know, we all assume we're not going to get sick and not need to use our medical insurance that much, but oftentimes that uh, will surprise you. And so you want to prepare for that. You want to make sure that you have the means to prepare for paying that deductible cost. What are some of the unforeseen consequences to the high deductible plans that are becoming so popular? Yes, yes. So they are highly popular now. And what will happen to a family if you're not prepared for this and you have to pay for the deductible, the survey actually found that a lot of parents found themselves then having to pull from very valuable family resources such as a family vacation fund or, you know, birthday parties or uh, gifts for our, our children. And some parents even had to dip into their college savings accounts that had put aside for their kids to cover these uh, medical costs. So very important to plan. And what can they do to prevent this? Well, you know, the good news is employers today are really in tune with helping their employees save for these important financial goals and providing uh, for these benefit costs. So employers are offering um, options such as voluntary insurance, which companies like Aflac offer. And these voluntary insurance plans can cover things like um, cancer, critical illness, accidents, and whatnot. So you wanna explore your different options. Also, companies nowadays will often offer a health savings account, or HSA. And if you have that, you should definitely look at that as well. And some companies actually even invite one-on-one -on -one consultants, such as myself, or financial advisors or benefit counselors to help you make these critical choices for you and your family. And if, and if you don't have someone like myself come in, then definitely take a look at the insurance company websites from your different choices. Call the 800 numbers and really dig deep and find out what the best benefits are for your family so you don't under as well as over-insure yourself. And do you have any additional tips or information I could share with us? Absolutely. So to learn more about, I think the, the survey results are really powerful, are very interesting, and I, I invite you to, to look into that. And you can find that and more information on voluntary insurance at afflec.com slash working mother.